You will start working with a physical therapist and occupational therapist on either the day of your surgery or the morning after your surgery. For every full day that you are in the hospital, physical therapy will work with you once to twice a day and occupational therapy will work with you once a day. The physical therapist will work with you on basic mobility, such as getting in and out of bed, standing up and down from various surfaces, such as a chair or a bed, walking, stairs if needed, and exercises. The physical therapist will work with you to determine the appropriate assistive device to use during these activities. The occupational therapist will help you with the activities of daily living, such as bathing, toileting, and getting dressed. You can get in and out of bed on either side. For getting out of bed, we recommend scooting to the edge of the bed first. Bring both feet off the edge of the bed and then prop yourself up onto your elbows and hands and finish scooting your hips around to the edge of the bed. To get back into bed, scoot yourself as far back on the bed as possible, angling your knees and feet toward the foot of the bed. If you are unable to lift your leg into the bed on your own, you can either have someone help you, you can use a leg lifter, or you can hook your non-surgical leg under your surgical leg to help lift it onto the bed. Avoid placing a pillow or other support under the knee. The goal is to have the knee straight when lying on your back. If you are having difficulty straightening the leg completely, you can place a rolled up towel under the ankle to help facilitate straightening of the knee. When standing up, scoot your hips to the edge of the bed or chair. The foot of your operated leg will be placed slightly more forward than your other foot. Place one hand on the walker and one hand on the bed prior to standing up. Lean forward slightly, pushing into your non-operative leg, and push into the bed with your arm to stand. When you go to sit down, you will want to place the foot of your operated leg forward and reach back for the surface with your opposite hand. You will not have any weight-bearing restrictions after your total knee replacement. You will use a walker for two weeks or when your surgeon clears you to start walking without a device. If you do not have the strength to lift your surgical leg off of the bed, you may need to wear a knee immobilizer to keep your knee straight for one to two days. This will depend on the strength as well as the nerve block they used in surgery for pain. When turning corners, do not pivot on your operated leg. Instead, pick up your feet and turn using several small steps. Frequent short walks are recommended. Use a handrail whenever possible when you are on stairs. When going upstairs, lead with your non-operated leg first, then your operated leg, and finally your cane or crutches. A family member should stay one step below. When going downstairs, lead with your cane or crutches, followed by your operated leg, and finally your non-operated leg. An easy way to remember these techniques is the phrase, up with the good, down with the bad. You may shower when approved by your doctor. You and your occupational therapist will discuss the correct technique for getting in and out of your shower stall or bathtub at home. We often recommend grab bars, tub transfer benches, and shower chairs to reduce the risk of falling in the shower. Your occupational therapist will work with you on the appropriate techniques for getting dressed. Some general rules to follow include, sit in a chair or at the edge of the bed while getting dressed. Dress the surgical leg first and then follow with the non-surgical leg. Do not cross your ankle over your knee when you are putting on pants, socks, or shoes. Avoid sudden changes in direction, pivoting on the operated limb, or twisting on planted feet.
Short Arc Quads Place a small towel roll under your knee. Tighten your thigh muscle by straightening your knee. Your heel should come off of the bed. Hold for several seconds. Repeat 10 times. Remove the towel roll after this exercise as you should not have anything placed under your knee unless you are doing this exercise. Heel Slides Slide your heel toward your buttocks as far as comfortable. Hold for a few seconds. Slowly straighten your knee back out. Repeat 10 times. Gluteal Sets Squeeze your buttocks together. Hold for several seconds. Repeat 10 times. We hope you find this information helpful, and we look forward to meeting you and delivering an exceptional experience.